I'm Dr. Karen DeFazio, an attending emergency physician and co-chair of the Stroke Committee here at Milford Regional Medical Center. Together with Community EMS and Milford Fire Department, we would like to take some time to talk about stroke. Stroke is a life-threatening condition that happens when your brain does not have enough blood flow. This can occur when blood vessels or arteries that supply blood to the brain get blocked or bleed. Anyone can recognize signs of stroke. If you think you might be having a stroke, don't delay. Come to the emergency department immediately. It's important to recognize signs of stroke because special treatments may help reverse the stroke if they are given soon after stroke symptoms begin. Anyone can recognize signs of stroke. The symptoms of stroke can range from mild to severe. You may have only one symptom or many at the same time. To help remember possible stroke symptoms, we use the phrase, be fast. Let's begin with B for sudden change in balance. This can be a feeling of off balance, dizziness, or a room spinning sensation. E is for eyes. A stroke can present with a change in vision, which can be a partial loss of vision or a complete loss of vision. F is for face. Facial droop can be a sign of stroke. This can be very obvious, but sometimes this can only be noticed when you try to smile. One side works and the other side does not. A is for arm. Weakness in an arm for example, inability to hold items as usual or inability to lift an arm. S is for speech, a change in speech such as slurring or inability to express your thoughts verbally. The T stands for time. Do not waste time. Calling 911 is usually the best way to get here safely and quickly. It is incredibly important to call 911 with any signs of stroke. When 911 is dispatched, an EMT will evaluate you, begin emergency treatment, and they will call the emergency department so we can be ready for you. On arrival, a stroke standby is announced overhead, and we will assemble our stroke team and get you the testing you need. An emergency physician will see you immediately and a neurology specialist will examine you either in person or on a video screen. After reviewing the CT scans, you and your care team will decide what treatment is right for you. These treatments may include a clot busting medicine or a transfer to even a higher level hospital for more specialized care. There is a limited window of time for medication to treat and potentially reverse the devastating disability from stroke. Every second counts to get a second chance. Don't drive, don't wait. Remember to be fast and call 911.